What is going on, everybody out there? This is Jake James Lugo, Senior Editor here at TheCoalition.com. I am back once again with a brand new unboxing and impressions video for you guys here on the channel. Today, we're going to be looking at something completely different than what we normally look at. We're going to be looking at the Gunner Optics, uh, two styles of these glasses. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have seen Gunner Optics before. You've seen a lot of different influencers, esports players, and various different Twitch streamers wear these glasses. But I've never actually looked at them myself, like up close and personal or really did an unboxing with them. So we're gonna look at them today. I got two styles of the glasses here. We got one that's Razer branded. If you guys know what Razer is, they do a lot of different PC equipment, a lot of other gaming tech, as well as also just the original branded Gunners, which we're gonna look at. Now, I haven't looked at these specifically, so I don't know what the models are as far as like looks or aesthetic is concerned, but we're gonna look at them together. But let's start off with the original brand, the Gunners. As you guys can see here, just look at the packaging on the back here. It's the only uh, patented computer I wear. Has a bunch of different stuff again, some of the branding, some of the logos and stuff. But here we go. Let's open this bad boy up and see what they have to offer. So don't forget, guys, make sure that you leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the Coalition's YouTube channel for more videos like this, as well as other gaming related videos that we have, including all our podcast shows and everything else. So. Here's what we have, I'm gonna put the box right here, stay on brand as it is. <laughs> uh, we got a couple different things inside. So we got this here, I'm guessing, is uh, some instructional material. From what I can tell, it's a user guide, very, very brief, it's a user guide. Uh, for optimal results, wear gunners when viewing uh, when viewing any digital display. So it could be like a, a television, a computer monitor, a computer screen. Maybe you're, if you have like a games case or something, you probably do that. use it up for that as well. But anyway, let's put that to the side. Let's look at this here. Again, this is just, I guess, a stand for it or whatnot. I guess it just says Gunner Optics. You know, maybe I could use that later. But let's look at the glasses themselves. So now they come in this little bag here. Okay, a little, little case. I'm guessing, like, if you're traveling or anything of the store, you want to be able to store them someplace nice. Let's look at the glasses. Here they are. Boom. Nice, stylish. They look really, really damn good. And even feeling them now, they feel very sturdy. Like they just came out the factory, which is always a good sign. Uh, on the side here, I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera, it's a little bit out of focus, but it says Gunner on the side, on both sides actually. On the inside, not really much. Again, they got a couple numbers, which I'm guessing has to do with the different, uh, what is it, the different types of styles or model numbers. And on the other side here, again, you can't really read it on the camera, but it says, inter was it Intercept Onyx, which I'm guessing is the model. It's called the Intercept, I'm guessing, and the color I'm guessing is Onyx as well. But these look pretty good, and what I'm gonna do is later, after we unbox the other one, I'm actually gonna try them on and actually put them on and wear them for you guys on camera, just so we could get a, a good idea of like what they are so I could show all of you. But again, on the back here, in case you can't really see that, again, it's a little bit dark, but it says Gunner on the actual back, but let's put that to the side here. That's one model of the Gunner Optics glasses. Let's look at now the Razer branded one. Let's see what this one has to offer. Uh, oh, they actually got a little thing on the side here. It says style, color, lens. Uh, Onyx, Amber, and Razer FPS. So this is the Razer FPS version of the Gunner glasses. But let's open it up, see what they have inside. It's probably gonna be very similar. Again, very similar to the other one. So let me put that here, close up the box. Put it here for everybody to see. Stay on brand. <laughs> uh, again, we got also the little stand here. Very similar, this just has a black logo for the Gunner uh, logo. We also have some more user guide stuff. Does it have anything different that we could actually tell? No, it's all pretty much the same exact stuff. So let's look at this. Now, the one main difference I could already see, which might be a little hard to tell on the camera. I'm gonna try to get in the light here. Maybe you guys could see that very, very briefly. But there's a Razer logo on it. It's the, instead of it saying Gunner on there, it says the, it shows the little Razer logo. But that's pretty cool. Let's uh, look at the glasses themselves. Here we go. These are a little bit thinner. Okay, and they actually come with a little bag over the little uh, side part of the glasses, which I'm guessing could be used for storage later or if you could just throw it out, really not much. But again, they feel lighter. They feel a little bit, not as like rigid and not as stiff as the previous model that we looked at before, but these still look nice. I'm not gonna lie, these look very, very stylish, especially if you like green. Uh, on the side here, as you can see, it's actually cut through. There's the Razer logo. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm gonna try to get it on the camera so you can see it a little bit better. You can see it's somewhat good. Again, it says Razor on the side. It's got the little thing right there on the side as well. And the same thing on the opposite side, on the left side, it says Razor. Uh, really not much on the insides there, but there we go. That's the Gunner Razor model, as you guys can see there. So these are the two models of sunglasses. So what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna have a quick cut right here, and I'm actually gonna put on both of them just so I can show you guys how they actually look on me. 
So here we are with that quick cut. I'm actually gonna be wearing both of the different models of Gunner's glasses that we just looked at right now. So let's start off first with the Gunner Inceptor, okay, which is the first model, which is the one with this type of back here that we're gonna look at. And to actually see how this looks on me. I actually got a wind, uh, was in a mirror right next to me here so I could look at it myself. Here we go, I'm putting these bad boys on. Probably look stylish, I can already see. Look pretty good, they look a little bit big for someone of my actual builds on my face and stuff. But I still think that these are pretty cool. Maybe I'll probably walk around with them a little bit prolonged throughout the day to see how they actually look, maybe get some other opinions and stuff. But let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of these model glasses here on my face right now. At least the Gunner Inceptor, the Onyx colored version of them. These do feel sturdy where they kind of feel like really locked hard onto my face, you know, so that way as I move around like this and stuff, they're not going to go flying all over the place or anything of the sort. But these feel pretty good as far as like big glasses are concerned. And again, looking at them right now, these look a little bit more bigger for my face than maybe what they should be. But let me know what you guys think about that. So that's the first model of glasses here. That's the Gunner Inceptor. So now let's take a look at the second model of uh, glasses here, which is the Razor right? The ones that are Razor branded. So let's check this one out. This comes in the green, or at least the, the black bag, I should say. It's not so much green uh, compared to the other one where it has like a red lace on it. But here we go. These are the Razor ones. And again, these look very similar. Like looking through both glasses, they have a very similar type of tint to them. I'm really curious to see how they're going to be when I actually start playing more of my games. Probably after I record this vlog, I'm actually going to be doing uh, some uh, stuff on my PlayStation 4. Probably playing a couple games like Street Fighter. Just so I can really take these out for a test drive. But from what I can tell right now, again, let me know in the comment section what you guys think of these on me right now. These look pretty good. Looking at them, this is a little bit more my build, personally, for me. From what I can tell on my actual mirror next to me, these look a little bit more me as far as like being stylish by also being ready to roll ready to just wreck up people online and stuff or again play some pc games get really deep dived into like a jrpg or something but these look pretty good to me these look pretty nice these feel a lot more lighter and they feel a little bit much more softer touch compared to the original inceptors that we looked at before so these are i guess you know could be for people that really want that hard grip on their face or that you know you're going to be moving a lot these will be pretty good for you as well as also again if you like the big rims just like the big frames and stuff these might be more your bad but if you want something with a little bit more for softer touch these gutter razors will be probably more your jam again uh, again, just to make sure, yeah, the Razor FPS. The Razor FPS is like the full name of it, but I just call them the Gunner Razors. But these are pretty damn cool. These feel pretty damn cool. I really dig both glasses, but really I'm curious to see what you guys think. So with that being said, that's going to do it for both of these, uh, was it, these Gunner uh, glasses. <laughs> this Gunner, uh, was it, optics unboxing and impressions video. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Again, this is a little bit different than what we normally do. I'm actually appearing more on camera. Hopefully you guys like that. Uh, let me know what you guys think of these glasses make sure that you guys leave a like on this video subscribe to the coalition's youtube channel for all our videos related to gaming unboxing videos podcast shows that we have including the co-op and tk spotlight and a whole bunch of other great content that i'm pretty sure you guys are going to enjoy i will talk to all of you again very soon peace out and stay epic everybody Watch out.